that is freaking awesome. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Just down behind the Surf Life Saving Club here. I'll turn to face the wind, hopefully it doesn't bother you too much. So I'm looking at doing this um, grass strip above the wall here and down on the flat. And then later on as the tide goes out, I might just go and hit the beach in front of the surf club. Alright, um, hopefully it's alright, I'll um, bring you back in on that first target. Alright, see you then. Alright oh guys, I've been here about 15-20 uh, minutes. Uh, yeah, found a few pull tabs and things. Um, but I've just pulled up an awesome find. Uh, this is another dirt drop off area that I mentioned in my relic hunt last week. Uh, one of the old shooting range. But anyway, I've got it just under the tab here. It keeps actually blowing over in the wind. But check this out. I just pulled another mini ball. So now that's two areas I've got that I know for a fact where the dirt's gone. Alright, so I'll keep going. Um, hopefully I'll find more. Okay guys, not very deep, um, say three inches down, not sure what this is, it's definitely got like a hex nut on the top and I can see partial thread, um, yeah, I'll give that a clean up when I get home, see if I can figure out what that is, very light, so that's cool. Got a killer signal here. High tone, 3435. That's it. Oh, very silty. Okay, a little bit on the plug cough. Shows me it's probably about another couple of inches down, so I'll hit something then. Oh, there we go. A couple of scoops out of here. Okay, it's on the cloth. Oh, a little bit of corrosion setting in on it. Yeah, I'm not sure. I can see Royal Life Saving Society. Alright, that's really cool. Definitely copper or bronze. Battery's going flat, so I'll just make this fast. This is a low tone 17, high tone 18. And I'm pretty close. Nice soft, silty ground, so it's pretty good. Oh, here we go, look at this. We got another one. That's 
just another mini ball. It's been fired. It's a flat on the top. Absolutely awesome. Look at that. You'd be lucky if we're four inches down. Starting to like this relic hunting. All right, so I'm just about by the truck, so I'm gonna swap over to beach gear and have a look there. Um, yeah, if I get any good finds, I'll bring you in. Um, otherwise, yeah, I'll see you at the breakdown of this video. Hi guys, welcome to the breakdown. Uh, sorry I didn't record any of the um, beach hunt, the uh, phone went flat, but um, yeah, picked up a bit of trash off the beach. Um, I'm not sure why, but just everywhere are these little tiny folded up bits of lead. Um, threes and four on the vanquish, but yeah, this is, these four here were from an area about sort of half a metre square. Um, bits of like worn down brass and yeah, another bit of lead there. Just, um, I just ended up just skipping them anyway, but yeah, there was nothing good to be found unfortunately off the beach. Um, up on the dirt prospecting mission I had here, I got a fairly fresh um, surface fine drop, there's a New Zealand 20 cent coin there. I got a 1 and that crusty 2, still haven't figured out what this little thing is, very light, but I um, thought that was pretty cool. And um, yeah, I found this uh, life saving metal and uh, yeah lucky enough to score another couple of mini balls a mate of mine that's a uh, historian had sort of given me a tip on this area his mates had sort of found a few bullets in the past there so bloody good tip and it's way too dry at the moment so during winter I'll head back there and hopefully uh, pluck a few more out the ground Okay guys, only a short one, thanks for viewing, um, please remember to subscribe, and uh, yeah, I'm off for a hunt tomorrow morning, Ian's going to join me at the park, so hopefully we'll get in, into some goodies, alright, bye for now.